Hello and welcome to Voices for Fun with Mona Marshall. Now today I thought we'd do something a little bit different. As some of you may know, I have a webcomic called Adventures of Puss and Dick, A Survivor's Guide to Relationships. My hands have a life of their own! Anyway, at, some ver at the advice of some wonderful people, including Yasmin Oshawa and Ani Karaglanyan, we decided we would take the first story and do it with limited animation, sound effects, and me reading. <laughs> so, there were four voices. And the, the challenge here, because when it goes into original animation, which we hope will be very soon, we're looking for dis distribution and producing, which means money. Uh, so if you know anyone, send them to me, monamarshall.net. Anyway, but I had to find how to do the four different voices. Now, the first one was easy, puss, because uh, it's just basically my voice. And even though eventually there'll be different ages, but basically I'm doing this. Dick, you are such a dick. Then the question was, I had two males. One, well, not really. One's an androgynous angel and one is Dick. Dick, I decided to do kind of a, a basic boy voice. So like this, whoa, that is the coolest thing I've ever seen. Okay, because after all, he is a young Dick. But then the challenge was, how did I do Venmar, the androgynous angel who represents inspiration? And I decided a lot of that would be done with my natural voice. Remember we talked about an Oriton voice? So a natural voice with as much resonance as possible. But if you think in terms of the rhythm of the voice, it's a lot calmer. And he's a bit of a smart ass, I must say. So a little bit of wryness and you've got Venmar the angel. Men are from Mars, women are from Venus. So those were the three voices. And then for the, <laughs> the little wise-ass bird who doesn't realize that he's dead, actually, that's Fido. And I decided I would kick him up here like this because he's kind of a little guy, you know? And uh, so kind of a, a little bit like the Rhymon. But if you notice what I'm using, it's that guttural voice, but it's pitched way up high and with lots of smile. So there you have it. Those are the four characters from Adventures of Puss and Dick. Tune in, turn on, and have fun. Thank you.